My name is Travis. I'm an Esri Senior Instructor. I primarily teach our ArcGIS Enterprise and Sharing courses. Today I'd like to show you creating custom roles to align the security of ArcGIS Enterprise with the business needs of your members. Let's make two custom roles to support the typical dynamics and business divisions that make GIS products. In this example, we need to support the business with a model where there will be one coordinating member and the other members will have limits on management of their own content applied to them. Let's call the first role the Division GIS Coordinator. They will be tasked with creating portal groups for sharing GIS resources with GIS and non-GIS subject matter experts. They will configure enterprise geodatabases and make them available to select portal members for sharing data from those geodatabases. Lastly, these coordinators will be responsible for managing other members' edits through branch versioning implemented in our geodatabase. To make this role, we will start with the default publisher role and add privileges. Signed in as an administrator, We'll go to the Enterprise Portal Organization's settings to find the member roles configurations. Let's create a new role and call it Division GIS Coordinator, then provide a short description. This role already allows the groups create, update, and delete privilege needed for group management. And the content register data stores privilege for managing access to our sensitive data. All we need to add is the version management manage all privilege. This allows our coordinator to perform data management tasks with other members' versions. We'll save the role and create our second role. For this role, we need to restrict the privileges of the members to prohibit the capabilities we just provided to our coordinator. Now we can give this role a name with a role description of following. Again, we need to choose the privilege compatibility with the highest levels and set our new role from our existing publisher role. However, now we will disable the groups create, update, and delete privilege, as well as the content register data stores privilege. Now the members won't be able to make their own groups or register their own data stores. So even if they have access to the data store for editing in ArcGIS Pro, they won't be able to share layers from it unless they have been granted access to an existing data store item created by our division GIS coordinator. Once this role is saved, we can apply it to our members as needed. There are many other situations where custom roles are helpful to meet your business needs. Take a look at this help topic for further suggested approaches to meet your needs. Thanks for watching.